it, again, it looks like Ryder should be the favorite on the men's side, especially having a home field advantage at their facility. Uh, St. Peter's, you know, had a great indoor meet, so we have to go after them on the women's side. But it's doable on both sides. Both men and women need to go out, compete, and do what they can. On the women's side, the fact that you lost indoors to St. Peter's, is that any extra motivation? Oh, yeah. Certainly is. You know, it puts a little fire in there for them. You know, especially for our seniors. They don't want to be the ones to go out not winning a MAC championship. And I'm sure they're going to do everything they can as a team to get the, get the rest of the team together and do everything we can in there. In terms of individuals, who are you expecting big performances out of? Uh, it's across the board. It's, you know, on the women's side, it's anything from the sprinters with Kara uh, Rostad, Heidi Palacios, uh, Ashley Bowman, uh, Jackie Hargrove. Uh, on the middle distance side, with Andy Koskinen and Maria Yangston. Uh, in the field events, the vault is going to be a big event for us with Melissa Yap and Sarah Moore. And in the jumps, especially Andre Nyback as a milky eventer, is going to be all over the place. Marlon Olsen in the long and the triple jump. So we're looking for a lot of different people to help us out in, in every area of the meet. And what about for the men? For the men, it's going to, again, depend on uh, a lot of different individuals. Scoring out the meet from the, the entry sheet, it looks like there's 13 different events. That's a lot of guys that can make a big difference in the meet, whether it's the throws with uh, Roman Abel and Colin Quirk, uh, uh, Rokas Kirillis in the jumps with uh, Albert Johnson, uh, Brian McGovern, uh, or in the sprints. Uh, Nick Estes is a little banged up right now. We hope he'll be ready for the meet. Uh, Carlos Petrovic to come through and Justin Chiparelli. Uh, and then even in distance events with Tobias Lundgren, both in the 10K and 5K, that's going to be a hell of a double. That's going to be tough. Uh, and I'm sorry I have to do that, too. Uh, <laughs> but along with him and in the middle distance events with Michael Royeres and Kevin Demick, uh, we have a lot of guys we're going to depend on in a lot of different areas, like 13 different events that can make a difference in the meet for us. Indoors, it came down to the real. I do expect the same. Easily. Uh, I'm hoping, actually, it does come down to that, that we're that close and that we can put it together. Our, our women's 4x4 is the best in the conference. Our men's 4x4 is one of the top three in the conference. So they just have to go out, and I'm hoping all they need to do is finish in that top three position for us to win the meet.